Hey there, welcome to Make. Make can help you synchronize your Google Calendar events with Notion. Let's dive into the details and show you how you can connect Google Calendar to a calendar within Notion so that every time a new event is created, updated, or canceled, it's going to be pushed to Notion automatically. All it takes is one single scenario. First, I'm going to set up a page called Make End Notion and put a calendar database there. Let's add a few more properties. One, event status, to see if an event was confirmed or canceled. Two, Google Event ID, to link Google Events and Notion items. This property will help us update corresponding items. Let's go to Make and create a new scenario. First, select a trigger app that kickstarts the automation process. In this example, it is the Google Calendar module that watches for event updates. It triggers every time an event is created, updated, or deleted. Click on the module to set it up. Create or select a connection to your Google account. See how easy it is? Select your calendar. Select to watch events by updated date. Include canceled events. Click OK. Once a new event occurs, a scenario will search for this event in Notion. Depending if the event already exists or not, the scenario will either create a new event in Notion or update an existing one. Search for the Notion app. Select the Search Object module. Create or select a connection to your Notion account. Select Search for Database Items. Select your database. Set up a filter, which will search for an item by Google Event ID property. Map the event ID from Google Calendar to the input field. Let's add a router to split the scenario into two flows. The first one will create a new item in a database, and the second will update an existing one. Click here to set up the first filter. Add a label, if doesn't exist, and select a condition, object does not exist. Then, set up the second filter correspondingly. Let's configure the Create a Database Item module. Select the connection. Select the database. Map corresponding data from Google Calendar to Notion fields. For the name, put Summary from Google Calendar. Map the status, event start and end, include the time, and map the event ID. Now, let's set up the module that will update existing items. Select the connection. Select the database. Map the database item ID from the Notion Search module. Map the corresponding fields as in the previous setup. For the name, put Summary from Google Calendar. Map the status, event start and end, include the time, and map the event ID. Now, let's see the automation in action. Go to Google Calendar and create a new event. You can manually execute the scenario by hitting this button here, and you can see the data moving quickly between the apps. A new item was successfully created in the Notion calendar. Let's move our event to another day and see what happens. Click to run the scenario once. And the timing has been updated. Cancel the event, and the status property of the item will be set to Cancelled. That's it. All that's left to do is to schedule how often you want the process to execute automatically and switch it on. What's even cooler is that you can utilize our extensive gallery of templates to start automating your workflows within minutes. Click on the filter option and search for Notion. Click on the app and you will now see a list of templates that feature integrations between Notion and other useful apps. The interactive scenario builder will guide you through the process of creating the scenario step by step. Sign up for a free Make account today, sync data between apps, and enjoy powerful automated workflows. Thank you for watching, and happy automating!